ask you your name and your position. Uh, Tamar Soleri and I'm playing Scrum Half. And uh, what nickname do your teammates know you by? Uh, they haven't got to know any nicknames over here yet. <laughs> I have no nicknames here. I have a few back home, but I'm not going to tell anyone because <laughs> they don't know them here yet, so I'll leave them figure out for themselves. What age were you when you were first introduced to a rugby ball? I was 13. I started playing in uh, Christian Brothers College in Cork, in my school back home. And uh, who, oh, that was the first team that you played for yeah, as well. Yeah. Yeah. And what rugby team did you support as a boy? I um, didn't really support any till, till I was 15 or 16, and I started following Munster, and obviously supported Ireland as well. And what was the first game of rugby you watched live? Um, it was, I think it was Munster versus Australia, in fact, years ago. When I was 14, I didn't know anything really much about rugby, and my dad took me down to it, so I think it was in Cork Han. I was around 13 or 14 anyway. So. And who's been the biggest influence on your career? Um, I suppose my, my parents, like they, I suppose they wouldn't have much to do with the technical side of rugby, but just in terms of my sporting career, obviously with GA previously I played a lot of that, and rugby, you know, I think they were you know, a big influence in my career, and uh, just all the coaches then in terms of rugby, but my parents definitely. Yeah. What are your parents' names? Uh, my dad is Sean and my mum's Cher. And uh, who's the best player you've played with and against? Best player I've played with would be probably would be Ron O'Gara. Um, just for for what he's done for Munster in Ireland, I think he's he's been exceptional. Uh, against probably Dan Carter, he's just class like. And uh, can you uh, uh, tell us something about yourself that people wouldn't necessarily know? Um, I'm extremely funny and extremely intelligent. <laughs> and uh, um, what is the, the best thing about playing for London Irish? Um, well, I suppose I might just start a plane, but you know, it's a good a young team, very exciting players, and a lot of talent. So I think hopefully we play an exciting brand of rugby. And they all seem like good, good lads, so just really enjoying it so far. And uh, what is it about watching live rugby that you think somebody contemplating going to uh, London Irish's next game would like? I think uh, you you can pick up a lot more than you do on TV. You know, in terms of uh, you know the whole structure of the defence and attack. You know, obviously, especially if you watch the game from behind the goals, you'll, you'll see where where the space is and how quickly that space kind of disappears. So. Uh, well, it might look like there's 10 yards of space for a side to attack, but then, you know, you, two seconds later, there's no space. So, you know, it's interesting when you watch a game live that, you know, you see where there apparently is space and how quickly that disappears. So, I suppose you get a greater appreciation of, you know, how difficult it is to, re to play the game, I suppose. Brilliant.